Yes, Eamon, what a tremendous night it was at the King's Hall, and what a fight with 33-year-old Davy Larmer crowned the new British bantamweight champion, outpointing Hugh Russell in a 12-round thriller, which had the 7,000 fans on the edge of the seats the whole way through. The headlines today say it all. Headlines for Larmer, his trainer Paddy Maguire, and the legion of Larmer fans to savour. After all, not many thought the veteran could win it. Great disappointment for Russell, of course, but a British title and the Lonsdale belt at last for Larmer. Well, I've dreamt about having one of these belts for a long, long time. Paddy had one. Uh, John Corwell, Freddie Gilroy, a lot of people have one. Uh, as I say, I've dreamt about it for a long, long time, and I knew if I'd have got the chance, I'd, I'd ever get it. Marvellous. How do you feel today? Uh, I'm just no different than I felt yesterday before the fight. Got a few marks, though? Yeah, well, you have to get wet when you swim. It was a hard fight again, wasn't it? It was. It was hard for both myself and Hugh. And uh, as Hugh said last night, we gave the crowd value for money. Did you ever feel in trouble at any stage? Not once. Not once was in trouble. At 33, some people wondered if you'd stick the pace, but you did. Yeah, no problem. 33, you just feel the same as I did when I was 23. No problem. Has it sunk in yet? You're a British champion? Not yet. Not really. I think uh, people around me are getting more of a kick out of it than I have yet. And you owe a bit to this fellow beside you? Oh, yeah. Paddy and I, core team, work well together. Paddy, I know you are hoarse from shouting last night, but it was a tremendous performance. Yeah. Yes, it was great. Davey, Davey done his stuff last night and he won the British title, which we wanted him to win. And I knew he would win. Yes, a I lot of people were writing him off and you knew he would win. I Why? I told telling everybody because when he fought Keith Russell the first time, he looked after himself and no fighter can look after himself. He wasn't in the right condition. And he got plenty of experience out of the first fight with Keith Russell. But Last night, he just dominated the fight. Q Russell is a smashing kid, but Davey just dominated him, and Q Russell has a heart as big as the King's Hall, the way he stood up last night and got off the floor. Every time Larmer had him, he still tried to fight back. And at the end, I think, uh, if you'd won it yourself last night, you couldn't have been more excited. Well, I was more excited. Davey Larmer won that title last night, and I was when I won the title. Marvellous. Well, Davey, uh... What now for a 33-year-old British champion? Well, so I'm going to take a few weeks rest and then we'll get together with Mr. Eastwood and we'll have talks and see what happens. I think a third fight with uh, Hugh Russell would really pack it out. Is there a chance of that? Yeah, possibly. Possibly. If Hugh, Hugh gave me the chance of getting the crack at it and I would more than likely give him a chance, but it's up to boxing politics and maybe the border control maybe not agree with it. But no thoughts of retiring as British champion? No, not yet. Not yet. Davy, well done, many congratulations. Thanks, Davey. Davy Larmer and a night to remember for him. The British Boxing Board of Control announced that Larmer must fight John Feeney on or before the 15th of June. Now, Feeney, you may remember, was the man that Hugh Russell beat in January to bring the title to Belfast. The board's decision has come as quite a shock because Larmer hadn't intended to fight until at least August or September. Ray Clark, the board's secretary, said today that only a bona fide medical certificate would be permitted for the fight to be postponed, and any other reason would mean that Davy Larmer would forfeit the title. Now, John Feeney has already beaten Davy Larmer, and that was just over five years ago. And last night, the Hartlepool man began his preparations to regain the title. He had a points win over Nottingham's Jerry Baird. Well, Feeney reckons he got a bit of a raw deal in the Ulster Hall when he was disqualified against Hugh Russell. But the feeling here is that the boxing board are asking an awful lot of Davy Larmer to make such an early defence of the title that he waited so long to win. Hugh Russell, the champion. Moving away, and Davy Larmer, the challenger, at 34 years old, hoping to cap what has been a tremendous and distinguished career for him by taking this British bantamweight title. In the last couple of rounds, it's been Larmer. And it's Larmer! Swigging against Natty tops the bill, of course, but let's not forget the main supporting contest. Belfast, Davy Larmer defends the British bantamweight title he won from Hugh Russell in March. That's against John Feeney. Hugh Russell, the champion. <laughs> Moving away, and Davy Larmer, the challenger, at 34 years old, hoping to cap what has been a tremendous and distinguished career for him by taking this British bantamweight title. In the last couple of rounds, it's been Larmer. And it's Larmer!
Lance Lama, he's done it. I've seen him fighting at his best. He's never seen me fighting at my best. He's a taller man than you. How, how are you going to approach that? Well, two-handed, probably. Yes, because you've shown that you've done a bit of punching. The fight before you took the title, I think, was probably a very good example. And I think in that fight, did you realize at the stage that you were behind in points against George? Oh, yeah. In the corner, Paddy, he was pulling the hair out. And I told him to give me a wee bit of time to think it, and you was behind in points. Of it. And when the bell went, I think it was for the sixth round, and I realized in my own self that I'd have to stop and put him out again to get the fight. So I just went out and threw a couple of hard punches and connected it. You reckon that's going to be the tactics against Feeney? No, I never plan tactics until uh, you can only box away the way the old fellas lose you to box, so we'll just have to wait and see what happens. With Barry McGuigan's European title fight and Davy Larmer's British title fight in Belfast King's Hall. Such has been the interest in tonight's bill at the King's Hall that this morning's weigh-in had to be held in an exceptionally large conference room. For the British bantamweight fight, Davy Larmer and the, and the challenger John Feeney 